this is Sound Out here, back with another Power Rangers review, this time of the Disney Store exclusive Moto Morse Ranger Red and Gold. Um, these are the Disney Store exclusives so far. I think they'll be released at retail without all this shiny chrome. That is chrome, by the way. Um, there, there is three in the set. I only found two, though. The third one is the Road Attack Zord, which looks the best. Out of all of them, I just couldn't find it. They had these two. They just got in these two, and they didn't have that one, though. Um, but I, I really like these guys. They also came with some nice engine cells. Uh, mainly why I buy Motor Morse. I bought the first set of Motor Morse, the first three, and I want to get the Green Ranger. I hope it gets released. Um, because they work as, they come with, uh, engine cells that work as Guardian, uh, Guardian engine cells, uh, which is nice. Now, um, these guys will come in multiple pieces in these nice boxes. They retail for fourteen fifty, which is pretty good. Um, and they turn to wheels. Uh, kind of like the road tax sort of does in the show. Now, the let me go over the engine cells. The engine cells are the main reason you might you're gonna get these at first, but once you get them, they're actually pretty cool. Um, gold comes with um, silver's number eight uh, Tiger Jet engine cell, which is actually silver, um, like all the Motomorph engine cells. And this, I think, is how they're gonna release this number eight cell um, at retail, because I don't think the Skyshift Blazer fits an engine cell. The Skyship Morpher probably comes with um, Gold's engine cell, uh, number 7. The Mach Megazord comes with the number 9, is what I think. I don't think Cloud Hatch it comes with one. And so this might be the way they're going to release it, um, is through this at retail. And you might as well get the Chrome. Just a few bucks more. It's just like a buck or so more to get the Chrome. Um, so, cool. Now, the Red comes with a engine cell for something you can't get, most likely, because I don't think they're coming out the... Um, wheel blaster, but here's its engine cell. Um, very nice. It looks like the wheel blaster's engine cell. It's silver. Um, it's got the racing thing and the G symbol. Uh, so that's pretty cool. It's got the wheel blaster um, engine cell. Uh, so that's pretty neat. Now these are used to uh, morph them. But let's go over the engine cell sounds first. Inside the cell shift morpher, number eight makes the uh, The morphing sound effects, uh, which is interesting. Um, they do not fall out. They're a little thick. They're a little bit thicker because they don't slip out of the morphers easily. You have to push them out. Um, and the wheel blaster uh, also makes the um, morphing sounds. Uh, the other motor morph, uh, or the guardian um, uh, engine cells, do you make the same sounds in this one? And in the Rev Shift Morpher, you can fit in number eight. Makes the same annoying vehicle noises. Um, and number, and not number, but wheel blaster engine cell. Um, same vehicle noises. Um, so no surprises there. Uh, that's what they do. Um, so anyway, I think those will make better sounds um, in the Sky Shift Morpher. Now you notice the Chrome is probably the... Now, I think the Chrome is the only thing that's going to be uh, very different about these. Um, and the retail release won't have the Chrome. Now, I'll start off with uh, Ranger Gold here. Um, he has two weapons that do come separate. Um, they come like this, or they can combine together, like I showed you. Um, he comes with his front of the wheel, or his shield, as they call it. Um, and he comes with the uh, little launch ramp. Which is cool. Um, there's also these two other pieces that will come separate that either go on his arms or on the back. They're complete the wheel part uh, of him. Now, I'll attach these wheel pieces uh, on here because I'll help with the morphing. So, to begin the morphing, oh, let me go over the articulation first. Um, so, the weapons are nice. Um, these guys are actually articulated as opposed to the motor morph, or the first motor morph. It's got 360 head, just a little bit locked. He's got 360 shoulders, um, he's got outward shoulder movement, he's got elbow shoulder movement, he's got elbow movement, he's got a uh, ball joint here, he's got rotation here, and a little ankle. Um, so he's very well articulated. That's because it was an all spring load transformation, um, unlike the, the first set of motor morphs, which it was. Um, so anyway, to start off, you want to clip these chrome pieces together up here. Um, shiny chrome! I love the chrome on these guys. I hate the chrome on the High Octane Megazord, um, the Disney Store exclusive one, but I love the chrome on these guys. Um, 
So you want to rotate this part back and then they clip in together. Uh, they should come back here. It kind of... Oh, that's... I got the panels on the wrong side. That's it. The panels only go on one side. Um, and then it just clips into here. Uh, complete this part here. So I'll show you that again. I want to rotate this around and then clip it in. Uh, like that. So it's all flush back there. You want to rotate this leg up. Fold up this part here, rotate this around, and click it into place. Um, rotate this up and around, and up and around, close it together. So, more much like the Japanese version of the uh, Road Attack Sword, um, Go Road of UT. Uh -huh. Now, you want to take this part, which is the part that's the spring loaded part, but you should plug this on, and there you got Ranger Gold in his wheel form. Um, very nice, very chromed out. Uh, I love the chrome on this. Um, no other chrome anywhere else. This is Power Rangers this time. Um, it stands on its own pretty well. Uh, the weapons do attach to the back. Um, you can just clip them on right here. Like this, which helps when you're um, using in the wheel mode. And then you have this little ramp part, right? Well, you can set it on the ramp. Um, this is the action feature. You can press this little lever back here, and it'll roll that off. Um, so that's pretty neat. Uh, the ramp also attaches to the back um, for the ranger form. To put them back, you have to push the engine cell in to pop the... Well, to pop everything apart. That was great. I'm sure there's another piece around here somewhere. Okay, well, there's this piece. Uh, I'm going to have to pick up pieces of this guy. Um, well, you're supposed to put the engine cell in and it pops out that middle panel. Ah, I can see the other weapon. Well, I can't show this completely now, but there's supposed to be a little black clip on here. Um, that I'll have to find later. Uh, but anyway, same way back. Um, I will try not to do this again with Ranger Red. Then unclip this part here and then rotate the arms around and all that. Now, for the weapons, uh, for everything to put back on him, take this part, it clips onto the back through those three holes, uh, so it's like that. Then you want to take these arms, these can go on the arms, or they can clip onto here. I'd just rather keep, keep them onto here, because you can't hold his weapons uh, with the clips on there. I think red looks a little bit better with the panels on him. Now, only uh, certain clips go in there. Uh, I, I got them backwards. Hmm. Uh-oh, I've only got two minutes for Ranger Red. What is this world coming to? Um, yeah, I think a part two will have to be Ranger Red. Uh, then you got this part here, which clips into his hand. Uh, it's supposed to be a shield. It's got the little black part on it, which is removable, uh, which is nice. And then you also have the two weapons. You can hold them individually, or if you want, you can clip them to the bottom here. Uh, like this to these nice chrome bits and then he's got a little gun weapon uh, which I actually prefer a little bit better um, and then with the panels it makes him look better and not have really skinny arms and a huge body um, so he's not looking like a Tyrannosaurus Rex uh, so well since the gold accident happened I can't do this in one video, uh, so I'll just do two videos. Um, so part two is going to have Ranger Red. Um, so it's going to have Ranger Red on here, and so you him, he's a little bit different, but same basic principle. Um, but I'll show you him in part two, so stay tuned for that. Um, I'll get to go pick up the piece of gold that I dropped. Um, so till next time, this is Santa saying goodbye.